everybody, Nostalgia Scott coming to you guys with part 8 of Crash Bandicoot Warped, part of the Insane Trilogy for the Xbox. So I think this is the last level we have to do, right? Or did we do them all? I think we did them all. So now we can go and get that one gem we're missing over here, right? I'm pretty sure. Let's go see. Yeah, we can go get the gold or yellow gem and hang them high. Nice. Pardon me, pal, but you gotta get out of my way. Really? What kind of challenge is that? I guess technically you could get the relics before this, but... Because it doesn't require to do them in any sp... <laughs> that was just terrible. I was gonna say, you don't have to do them in any specific order, but then I end up doing that and just botching it, so that's the thing, I guess. Like, it wasn't even a challenge, man. I just literally, like, failed the, an easy jump. Because I was like, oh yeah, let me jump on here and then continue to move, despite, you know... I like when the carpets are like this, because they're super easy to... What the heck was that? Like, I double jumped without meaning to double jump. That was weird. Oh, lordy dordy. Actually, I think you do need the double jump for this. Also, this is taking a while to go over here. Oh, there's the gem! Nice. And that's the end of the level right there. Ah, yes. There we go. There's the yellow gem. Not bad. Ah, I believe that's all the colored gems, right? Rightio. Right, now we can go take on World 3 and do these ones. I, isn't it a dinosaur level? Oh yeah, we still have the gem here, so we'll probably do that one last. So we'll probably go level 15. Yeah, we'll go do double header. Since we can actually do the relic here. I don't want to do the, the gem ones first because... Yeah, you know. Just just logic, I guess. I love that this Aku Aku just stayed Aku Aku. Oh, that, that slowed me down. I didn't mean to jump on it. I meant to spin into it. Whoa. Beep, beep, buddy. We're not waiting for anybody today. Whoa. Oh, that's not at all what I wanted to have happen. Oh, that's gonna, that's gonna cost us the gold. Ow. That is definitely not what I meant to have happen either. There we go. Continue on. Don't stop for anything. Luckily, these luckily none of these levels in this game are too long. I could never get the relics in Crash 4, though. That game is notoriously difficult. Like, holy cow. That game really makes Crash Bandicoot feel like a Dark Souls game of platforming, you know? Like, let's just continue moving. Don't, don't stop. It's also really hard to commentate on these. Because they're just, you know... Wait a minute, I, I didn't realize I could run on the outside of the water. Get out of here. Adios, I need to get in here. Oh, we actually got the gold, despite our screw-up. Is there a problem, Granny? Earn ten go relics, gold or better. Okay, yeah, because we have... We have eleven... But only one of them is uh, Sapphire. So that's pretty good. Alright, what do we got? We got Road Crash now. Accelerate just before the light. Yeah, I know. I always try this, but... For some reason, it doesn't literally let me accelerate, which is really weird. Also, those are time stop boxes. Nice. I'm pretty sure most of the boxes in these are time stop because, like, look, there's only 25. I still think this is the most difficult of all the, uh, the, the racing levels, though. The third one provided, like, no real challenge. Like, it felt like an easier version, you know, of, like, this one. Oh, we missed that one. But we also shaved off a few seconds, so... I heard something crash behind me, and it wasn't me, despite my name being Crash. 
funny how they made that like a th like three seconds worth just you know just because there were three together. Woohoo! Now remember, you don't technically need to come in first. You just need to beat the time, which I find kind of funny, you know. That the time and coming in first aren't actually linked together. I'm pretty sure coming in first is the platinum. Man, if you could hit all four of those, that would be juicy, but sadly I didn't hit all four. And you gotta like go right at the end there before you come crashing over here. And that's probably gonna cost me, because boy is that sharp corner difficult. I think you need to at least get to second though for gold. At least I feel like that's what it is. Also, is it me, or is this level longer than the other ones? It really feels longer than the other ones. Then I'm just going crazy. I'm not entirely sure. I could just be going insane. After playing so many video games your entire life, you might just go physically insane. Yeehaw! And the fact that we're also in a motorcycle instead of a car might also provide some kind of, like, challenge for this. But there we go. Did we get it? Oh, we got gold. <laughs> Thought maybe we got the platinum, but I kind of figured we wouldn't get the platinum. But there we go, we're still only missing one. And I bet you I can go back and do that one. Just for the achievement. Alright, now we got this level. Which is hang... I was going to say hang high, it's high time. Not even remotely close. Oh, this one's going to require us to go through all of this, really? Oh, and none of these are time stop boxes. Oh, I, I definitely messed up. Hurry up! Ain't nobody got time for you, man. Hurry up, go! Go! Go, you could at least give me a bunch of time stop down there, so at least it would have made up for all this. Ugh, go! Get out of the way. I really wish we could continue on. Thank you for breaking that. I'm just gonna gun through them. Go! Just, this one I'm not a big fan of because this is like the longer of these type of levels. Also that's completely useless so we won't have to worry about that. Thank you for that. There's the death platform. Technically we made it. Even though we don't need to. There we go. Come on, come on, come on, come on. We're almost at a minute already. Wait, that took up both my Aku Akus that I would have got? Or is it because I used... Oh. Well, we get to try again because I'm an idiot and got stuck on the wall anyway, so that's a thing. Go. Oh my god, is it seriously going to make me wait for this one every single time? The fact that you have to waste so much time just right here is ridiculous. There we go, and we got that one too. Then we can kind of cheese that. And we can do that. This one is definitely going better, except for that part. I hit that one on purpose. That one I did not hit on purpose. The darn uh, thing just did not want to work there. Okay, luckily there's a restart button, so... Yay! I wasn't expecting this one to provide as much of a challenge as I was expecting. Also, can you like hurry up please? This is just super ridiculous that we literally have to wait for you. Come on, game. Thank you. What was that? Man, the whole slowing down there thing got me. But go. Oh. Yeah, man, this just takes way too much time right here alone. Also, why did it, like, completely make me lose momentum? I don't appreciate that, but whatever forts the game's boat, I guess. Alright, Mr. Uh, Scorpion. Mr. Evil Dude. The fact that I have to cut through there like that, though, is ridiculous. Um... I was on the carpet game. Thank you for not caring, but yay. 
Oh, this level is making the blood boil. Holy cow. See, no matter how fast they do that part, though, it's always about the same amount of time. It takes over 10 seconds just to climb this tower alone. Why did the game do that to me? Why did I slide the other way? Did you see that? Go, go, go. Stopping for nobody and no thing. No one, no anything. Also, like, why does it keep, like, sending me through everything? Okay, no, it's screw it. I'll take the hit, just because I know I can then make it over here. Hurry up. I don't remember the med- Double jump. You do know how to work, right? There is a thing called double jump in this game, and I know for a fact that it exists. Yeah, I see. Made it faster here, but due to the fact that you have to wait still is ridiculous. I don't know why I just didn't do that the first time instead of just jumping on it. There we go. And then we can just technically crawl past that one, kill him. See, for some reason, it likes to go through that one instead of... Uh-oh. Oh, come on, come on, come on, come on. We are doing so good, and then the game's like, Oh, yeah, you know what? No. Oh, hurry up, hurry up, hurry up, hurry up. Go! Oh, I was gonna say, did they not give it to me that time? But, you know, it did. Thank the heavens, because I was... Also, why did that work? That was weird. Oh. I see what we were supposed to do here. Nice, this is way better. Hurry up, hurry up, hurry up, hurry up! Come on, buddy! We're wasting our precious invincibility frames on nothing. There we go. Ah, oh, we only got Sapphire, but at least we got it. So we can say we got this level done. That's pretty good. I'll take it. Once again, one of my worst ones, but whatever. That was level 13, right? So now we gotta go level 12, which I'm pretty sure is the water level, so let's go to it. Deep Trouble. These levels we can kind of just, like, mass swim through. Like, spin through like this. Oh. I completely botched that, but... Actually, it might be better for us just to go like this. Well, that was just me being an idiot. Hurry up. Hurry up, electricity. Okay, let's just continue on. Let's not drop the ball for anyone or anything here. Oh, thank God there's a time stop crate right there, not something super dangerous. Wait, why did I get Wumpa Fruit? You normally don't get Wumpa Fruit in these. I'm so confused, because when you die here, it doesn't technically count. And that's the thing, like, it just straight up doesn't count. Alright, these parts are the most annoying part, because you do have to wait for them. There's literally nothing you can do. You can't even, um... Now you can just technically take the uh, speed boost here. Never mind, despite taking the speed boost. Sorry. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Oh, thank god. There we go. We actually got gold, despite playing that like a total chump. Thank you. I'll, I'll happily take a gold. Why won't it do click it? Thank you. Nice. So technically now we're only missing two golds, which I don't know if I can get the, ha the high time one, though. All right. Now let's go get both gems here, and then the relic, and that might end off this episode, depending on how long it takes. Yellow gem, yeah. So, technically, you can't do this one until the post-game. Also, where's the... Oh, there's the time stop. So, this one we actually do... Actually still have to get everything, so... Unlike the other levels where we needed the, uh... 
color gems to 100%. This one we actually do need to fully complete still. And there's 112 boxes, which is actually quite a few if you think about it. Sorry, Crash Wannabes. Ah, that killed that guy. That's funny. Oh, and there's the yellow gem path pathway right there. Right on. Wait, why are there speed boost, uh, like, little water sections here, despite... Okay, right, nothing behind us. I don't even know how many boxes are in here. I know you're there, Mr. Enemy. Whoa, this looks... This looks actually pretty, uh, trippy. I keep forgetting, I don't have to rush anymore. I'm so used to this, the time trials that that dong-shaped lava doesn't actually have to be as much of a threat anymore. How did that hurt me? Despite the first one not hurting me. Oh look, more TNT! Yay! I feel like there's gonna be a dinosaur segment here too. Oh. There we go. The super body slam ability coming in clutch. Let's go. Actually, weird question, but are there checkpoints here by chance? Oh, at least there's checkpoints. Why do I have a feeling this is going to be difficult? Hang on. Ugh. I gotta scratch my eye, it's annoying. There's 31 relics. Wait, why is there 31 levels? Which level technically... Oh wait, no, that means there's... I actually don't know. Oh god. Nitro! Oof. Oh, there's the gem, nice. Well, that's what the nitro switch was. Nice, cool. Wait a minute, what is this? Oh, that's pretty cool. Just a bunch of lives over here. Because for some reason didn't jump on the platform anyway, so now we can go back. Now we can actually beat the level normally. Now, do we actually have to backtrack at all? Oof. We do have to backtrack at least a little bit. Alrighty then. We actually have to backtrack quite a bit! Oh, jump scares. Oof. Was not expecting that in a child-friendly game, man. Stop that. Stop giving me a heart attack when I don't know where... Oh, thank God, there's a checkpoint. Woo. And as soon as I get the checkpoint, I step on the lava. Okay. Woo. Talk about a heart attack, though. Man, that was... That was concerning. Also, why is there, like, nothing here? One thing I don't like about a lot of these levels is the backtracking you have to do once you get to the gem plat... Or, if you take the gem pathway. Wait. There was an egg back there, too. I guess there's, like, checkpoint eggs, right? Hmm. You know, I'm gonna take you. Let's go, lizard boy. Let's go back this way. Technically, you can't... I'm as an Aku Aku. Yeah. Wait, what? Um, game, you do realize I wasn't in the lava, right? That was just called water? I don't remember water being hot. But there wasn't even a geyser, man. What, what the heck was that? Oof. Oof. Now, as long as I don't run into the, the Crash Bandicoot wannabe again, I should be fine. Alright, no Crash Bandicoot wannabes, okay? Okay, no idea what the heck that was, but... Okay, they just seem to spin you around. There's a little fly, but... Okay, now we can go back. I don't know if I approve of how much backtracking you have to do. At least we destroyed all the nitro. But well, that's still a concerning amount of boxes. But then again, I guess we still have the uh, minigame to do. So I guess that's the thing. Also, we did have double jump by this point, so that might be why this level's kind of difficult. 
Hey, the dinosaur's out now. Yay, dinosaur, let's go. I didn't know that, like, because I've never died where there's a checkpoint with the dinosaur, so I didn't know that you could actually technically get a second dinosaur. That's actually news to me, because that's never happened before. Then you lose him right here anyway. Alright, goodbye, Mr. Dinosaur. Thank you for... All these crates, I guess. Um, where is... Oh, I guess it's just up above, right? I was gonna be like, where's the crate? It's just up there, okay. And bonus game, yay! I can't remember if I did the bonus game in this level before. I mean on video, I've done it before obviously. I think I did it, forgetting that this level is one that we couldn't 100% like all the boxes. So yeah, this is the one where I think it tells you about this power up. Maybe? Yeah it is. Yeah, I think we did this one on screen before. I love how I can just time that right there and get it, like, just beautifully. And there we go. Another bonus game done, and I sadly finished my drink. Yay. Alright, we almost got all the boxes, and we haven't even done the dinosaur sections yet, so... I guess that's something. Let's go! Alright, you get that one for me, pal. Being able to run here, though, makes these dinosaur sections, like, oddly easy. Because, like, he'll never really catch up to you unless you just completely stop and start walking or something silly like that. Okay, we still need five more. Actually, I can't remember if he could get... Or if he could break that for you. Okay, that was all of them. I'm not losing another gem silly like that, you know? And there we go. That's almost all the gems in the game, too. Now all we have to do is go back and get that relic, and that'll open up the next level up top. Let's go. Alrighty. I'm assuming that Aku Aku will stay in Aku Aku then. Yeah, see the Wampa Fruit disappears, so I don't know why in that one part of that one level the Wampa Fruit seemed to have stayed. Oh, that's gonna cost me some valuable time, clearly, because those were time boxes. That was on me. Get out of my way, dude. You, you slowed me down. Out of my way, you wannabe weasels. I actually don't think he'll help us, because I'm pretty sure we're faster with our running, right? Oh, that was beautiful. How I just glided through that like that. Mmm, glorious. I'm pretty sure this is faster. I don't actually know if it is. Let's go. Oh yeah, man. This. No, we died. Okay, maybe we'll get the dinosaur. Maybe the dinosaur is technically, you know, faster. We'll see. Oh, that was on me again. I've been taking a lot of dumb uh, hits by hitting the steam in this in this level for some silly reason. How come I killed them that time, but not the first time? Wait, did he eat me? I think he ate me. That's pretty cruel and unusual game. Those don't look like things that would eat us. They're like weird derpy toothless seals. I guess if they're like Toothless the Dragon, I could see it. Why does something random always seem to hurt us? It ate me again. Nice. For some reason, my jump... I am assuming why I have issues playing games on Xbox for you guys is because my Xbox is facing a wall. So the sensor for the controls behind it, so certain things just have a hard time registering. And that time we didn't take stupid damage on the stupid little seal guy. Bandicoot seals for the lose, I guess, you know? Silly things like that. There we go. See, I can't tell if it... Okay, no, it's, de it's definitely slower, so we're definitely going to get rid of that. 
Because, yeah, it's slower than us like this. It's faster than his walk speed, but slower than his run speed, that's for sure. So, we'll keep going. We still have our Aku Aku this time, unlike last time. So, we'll keep that in mind that we should technically have an advantage here. Now, let's hope some of these many boxes over here are what we need. Thank you. I don't know why I would ever grab those ones, because they'll seem out of the way, you know? There we go, we got Wunga Gao again. Let's go. Now, we only have to do this dinosaur section once, though, so that's a thing. Oh yeah, he technically stops them for you, so you don't have to really worry about those. But let's just keep going. Don't stop for anything. And there we go! And we got gold! That's what I'm talking about. Man, getting a platinum on a lot of these would be a pain in the butt, that's for sure. So anyways, if you guys enjoyed this video, please remember to leave a like, comment, subscribe, hit the bell for notifications, join the Discord and the Patreon in the links in the description, and I will see you guys all next time for some more Crash Bandicoot 3 Warped. Bye bye guys.